Hello, darling. I mean, <clears throat> what's up, YouTubers? This is Dom Cree doing my review of the Over the Rainbow Elvira, Mistress of the Dark action figure, known as the Pride theme version. But it made, it is also made from NECA. So, this figure I ordered on eBay, and I was expecting this figure to be delivered yesterday, but it got delayed. But here it is now, and I was really happy that I'm excited to get this figure. And it came in the mail today, and it's this is Pride Month right now. We're in June, so I am very excited, because it's Pride Month. Yeah! So, we are all loud and proud. Here we have Elvira in her rainbow dress. And we have right here, there's Elvira right there. Even though it has played by Cassandra Peterson. We have other cool accessories, but we'll get to those in no time. It says Over the Rainbow. And on the back, we have the cool um, picture frame of Elvira. And the face expressions from Elvira. And the other side, we have Elvira right there. And also, we have Elvira on the back, and it shows us her doing some expressions, and the yellow brick road, and stuff like that. All right, let's get this Mistress of the Dark out of the package. And here we have Elvira outside of the package. Let's take a closer look at the figure. And this figure looks realistic. It just looks like the likeness of Elvira, like Mistress of the Dark, even though it's just, um, oh, the makeup looks pretty good. And it doesn't have, like, oh, yeah, her face can come off. So, um, if it can only fit onto the other Elvira figure, if I can do my old ones. Um, I don't want to go get to that later. The dress looks good, and she's wearing, like, a red um, belt. It's actually Velcro. And she's got same nails and, oh, long fingernails. Ooh. Ah, love that update. And she's wearing, like, um, glittery high heels, like, pumps. But she's not wearing tights, but um, the dress looks fabulous on her, and she's wearing black underwear underneath. Um, she might be looking like she's wearing, like, the ruby slippers, like, from The Wizard of Oz. And, oh, she's got her um, Aunt Morgana's ring. That's placed on her hand. And I think the makeup might be a little bit the same. And her lips look good. And her, let's take a look at her melons. And as, as you all know, this is, this channel and this video is for adults only. So, no kids allowed. So we're going to move this right here. So is she, same here, she has no nipples at all, but we have like... Um, stain marks on her boobs. But um, I might have to do something about that, fix that. We'll get to that in no time. Um, yeah. So accessory she comes with is this the stand, which is the yellow brick road. It has a signature on there. It says Elvira, which you can place her, like she has peg holes on the bottom of her feet. You can put her on there. And also, she has um, interchangeable hands with the open hands, as you can see here. And she also has her book, her very own book. And she can only hold it in her hand, but if she has any grip hands. Um, in the back, you can't even read that. What? I also have a flag, which it's actually blank, but it also comes with stickers, whichever you want to prefer. For her to, to use, like, I can only use, like, the rainbow stickers or this stickers or which one ever. And her other annual changeable face with her um, shocking face. Like, I don't know which kind of impression like that. So, um, so what we're going to do is we're going to put um, stickers on, on here. So, we're going to just place it carefully. Like, are they removable stickers? Maybe, yeah. Maybe I should do, like, the, the flags, like so. That's actually supportive for anybody else who can 
support the LGBTQ vibes. Just like that. Which I, I dig. So you can actually fit this in your hand like so. You could just place it right there. Like that. Like she can hold it. Like she's celebrating pride for everybody. And also she can also hold her book. But I don't know if she can. Yeah, she can. And also we can actually switch out her hands like so. She so just pop this off right there. That's easy. So you could just put this one on here like so. You can do the same thing for this hand. And there you are. You have her open palm hands. So you can actually switch out the face. It's actually easy. So you just pop this off and place it on here with this one. Oh, <laughs> her boobs were showing. Her ni no nips are showing. Sorry. All right. So you can actually make her do something like this. Like she's screaming or something like that. <laughs> Like you're making her channel Macaulay Culkin from, um, from um, Home Alone film, like so. Yeah, but let's do a comparison with Elvira and the rest of the Elvira NECA figures. Here's a comparison with the Over the Rainbow Elvira standing next to alongside with the original Elvira and the Holiday Elvira. As you can see, she is pretty much in the same scale as the these two other Elvira figures, which I probably want to use this Elvira, the over the rainbow Elvira to put onto the original Elvira head sculpt and see if I can do that off camera, which I don't know. We'll, we'll see. And for the articulation with starting from the head, her head can look up that much, but it can't even look up that much because her hair is in the way. You can look down very much, can pivot from side to side, go all the way around 360. Oops, and her face just fell off. And let me just put it back on. Oops, I just got it upside down. And see, there we go. And whoops, sorry. <laughs> okay. And arms do go in and out, can go all the way around 360. But be careful because of this fabric, can get, don't want it get ruined. Okay, there we go. And we have bicep swivel, we have double jointed elbows, wrist hinge, and a swivel right there. And we have a diaphragm joint right there, can twist right there. Let's can kick forward and kick back and do the splits. And also we have a thigh cut swivel, we single jointed knees, and feet hinge, and of course the ankle pivots. Okay, that about wraps up my reel. So... For my final thought for this figure, I pretty much love it so far, and I dig it so much, and I do love the pride theme Elvira figure, and I cannot get her into the final pose. And so I love it so far, and I'm hoping that the uh, this head sculpt can try to fit it on the, um, if I can switch it on to the original um, body, I don't know, if that works. I don't know. But anyway, if you guys like this video, give my video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below what you think. Subscribe to my channel. Think about every time I upload. And also follow me on Instagram. And also share this video to your friends and family. And give me a lot of likes for this video. And because I deserve some likes. So thanks for watching, everybody. And hopefully have a happy pride, everybody.